Oh my Lord Jesus. Good morning guys, um, it is about 6am so while baby is still sleeping I'm going to go ahead and hop in the shower. Um, this is the diaper bag I was telling you guys about in my last vlog. It is amazing. I will link it below but I stuffed it to the max, okay? So now we are headed to the airport. So my husband is checking our bags, the car seat and the stroller. Um, I decided to bring both because I'm getting a rental car and I'm also going to be hanging out with friends. So it would just be easier for me to move around with baby. Oh, he looks so cute and scrumptious. Now, these are the only two bags I'm taking with me on the plane. Um, the gray bag has my pump, um, extra bottles. It also has my cleaning supplies to clean my pump and bottles. So the diaper bag uh, actually has my purse stuffed in it. I'm going to wear that as my book bag and I'm going to carry my pump in my hand. So the less that you have to take on the plane, the better. <laughs> so I walked to the wrong one. And as you can see, I'm sweating. I was trying to go to Chick-fil-A, but they open at 7. I'm sorry, they open at 8 a.m. And my flight is at 8.34, so I don't have time. But it's... I walked all the way to C10, so he's taking me to eight, uh, C31. Now you don't have a to moment to locate the nearest one. Suggestion, but um, we played a lot before we boarded the plane, so you know you kind of want to wear them out <laughs> before you take off, so they can sleep as the plane takes off. Uh, another good idea would be to feed your baby um, right at liftoff, so their ears can pop. Um, or as you can see, uh, he has on earmuffs, so that works too. Depending on your baby's feeding schedule, um, I suggest bringing as many bottles as you need. Um, my baby eats every three hours, so I brought two bottles because the flight was two hours. And then once we get off the flight, we had to go get a rental car. By then it would be his next feed. The clip-on pacifier is a lifesaver, okay? You know we lose pacifiers, they throw them on the floor. All you have to do is clip this one on it works perfect okay for the most part um, my baby slept throughout the whole flight all right y'all we are at baggage claim waiting on my bags i'm so proud of him he did so good he's asleep right now but he did so good on the plane and um everybody else was like oh your baby did so good i was like thank you listen I overpacked his diaper bag for any and anything for anything that could possibly go wrong. If he started whining, I had two bottles on deck. I had toys. I had pacifiers. I had books. Anything you could think of, I had it. So um, I'm about to get a cart. I'm about to get one of these carts and put all our uh, luggage on here, and then we have to go get a rental car. Oh yeah. It's not over. Luckily, there was a nice uh, husband and wife that helped me put all this stuff on the cart. So now we're about to go get a rental car.
my Lord Jesus. I couldn't even record everything that I was just doing. Oh my God, this man that works works at the, um, the rental place had to come and help me put my suitcases in the trunk, my stroller back there in the trunk. Look at my hair messed up. Um, I put the baby, of, I, of course I ain't let nobody touch my baby. I put the baby in the bag in his car seat and I just had to rig, see the mirror back there? If you can see it. I had to rig the middle seat so I can put the mirror back there so I can see baby because girl, I can't be driving around without seeing my baby. Um, but uh, yeah, cause the headrest, it doesn't go up or down back there. So I had to do that. It has taken me 20 minutes, 20 minutes to do all of that. So now I'm about to go look for something to eat. And then we're gonna head to Khadija's house to let her see the baby real quick. And then I'm going to my mom's house. We have a doctor's appointment for her. All right, y'all, so that is what it's like traveling with an infant, a baby, a newborn, toddler. It is not easy, okay? And it is not for the week. Um, it's a lot. You definitely need someone else um, with you to travel. Now, although I said you definitely need someone to travel with when you are uh, flying with a baby, infant, newborn, um, but don't get it twisted. It can be done. Like you can travel with your baby by yourself. I mean, clearly I just did that. <laughs> it is just a little bit more work is all. So if you would like a stress-free flight, I definitely suggest flying with someone, okay? Because... It was so hard doing a lot of stuff. You know what? Thank God, though, because he really sent some people to help me out because a lot of people were just pitching in. But yeah, so um, that's the end of this video, guys. And the next video will be uh, an Atlanta vlog. Make sure you subscribe to my channel. Follow me on Instagram. And I will see y'all on the next video. Bye.